It's so annoying. Hey everyone, I'm Donna and you're watching Wanted Adventure Living Abroad. I recently made a video about some of the German things about the apartment that I live in. Now, how about what annoys me the most in here? And there are a few contenders, but one takes the cake. The fact that my apartment and most apartments in Germany don't have air conditioning for the warm summer months can be a little annoying, especially when it's warm at night and I'm trying to sleep. But for the most part, I don't really mind not having AC in Germany so much. There were only a few days this past summer here in Germany when I thought, hmm, it might be nice to have a little, keyword here being a little, cooling in the apartment. In South Florida, AC was a must, but here in Germany, I'd say I'm pretty okay without it. Something I loved having in some of the homes that I lived in in the US was an ice cube maker in the freezer. Extra bonus points if the freezer also came with an ice cube dispenser built into the door so that I just had to press my cup up to the lever on the door and out came some nice cold ice for my drink. Here in Germany, my freezer does not have an ice cube maker, let alone an ice dispenser. So Stefan and I either make our own ice in ice cube trays or we buy ice from the store. A little annoying if I forget to make a fresh batch of ice and then I realize that I want some, but eh, again, not really so bad. And the last annoying contender that I have for this video, I made a whole video about how I just love the amazing windows in Germany, but I think it's really interesting and annoying that my windows in the apartment in Germany did not come with screens on them. When I moved into this apartment and every other apartment that Stefan and I looked at renting, the windows were just open, no screens on them to keep the bugs out. One of the first things that we did when we moved into this apartment was put some screens up on some of the windows. And when I say we, I mean Stefan put some screens up on some of the windows. Thank you so much to Stefan for helping keep the bugs out of the apartment. But the winner for most annoying thing in my German apartment is, drum roll please, the laundry rack in the kitchen situation. In the kitchen kind of being the key words here because it's not that I necessarily mind hanging laundry to dry in and of itself. I actually find it kind of calming and peaceful to hang up the laundry. I just wish that I had somewhere to put the laundry racks that wasn't in the way. We don't really have room in our living room to put them. We could put the rack in our bedroom, I suppose. And sometimes we do do that. For example, when we're having guests over, but especially if the stuff is drying overnight, it really causes the room to be quite humid. And other than that, we don't really have anywhere else in the apartment to put them. I guess we could put the laundry rack in the hallway or right in front of the front door, but then we wouldn't be able to walk down the hallway or in and out of the front door. So most of the time, kitchen it is, which annoys me for a few different reasons. Number one, the clothing rack, or sometimes racks, sometimes we have to put two out at the same time, takes up space in the kitchen. Where we have room for the laundry rack is right next to the window. So then opening the window becomes a bit of a hassle. And they also just kind of ruin the whole atmosphere of the kitchen. Like we sit down to eat a lovely meal and then hanging there right next to the table are our socks and underwear. It's kind of a weird vibe. And then there's the fact that cooking creates smells. And sometimes those smells transfer to the clothes that we just cleaned and made smell so lovely. So now instead of smelling like lovely smells, our clothes and towels smell like broccoli and potatoes and cheese. I'm sorry, 
I like broccoli and potatoes and cheese, but I don't want my clothes to smell like that. Maybe one day we'll have an office or some other kind of area in the apartment where we can put the laundry racks and then I think they'll be a lot less annoying. They'll be a little out of the way, but for now, this is simply how it is. So my question for you is, do you hang your laundry to dry? Where do you put the drying racks? And what's the most annoying thing in your home? Please let me know in the comments below. Thanks so much for watching. Until next time, Auf Wiedersehen. Want to watch another video? Here are two. And a really, really, really big thank you so much to our patrons on Patreon who help make these videos possible. Thank you so much for your support.